live in my office at Weller's Utility Trailers in Bridgeville. You can also watch us. You can go right there and take a look and say, what do these guys even look like? Uh, what kind of hairdos are they sporting and so on? We are live in my office at Weller's in Bridgeville, and you can watch us at Weller Does Del Marva. Dot com. That's on the World Wide Web, but if you're still using the local web, it will still work, won't it? I would think so. You have no idea what I'm talking <laughs> about. So anyway, folks, good morning to you. It's been an interesting week. Did we have more than one snow shower this week, Brooks? Isn't that amazing? And um, you could still see the blacktop. So anyway. <laughs> so it didn't really account to Didn't anything. really account to anything. But um, it's a coming. And uh, we got all kinds of interesting things here at Weller's. But this is a weekly show we do. Uh, I got Dr. T, Dr. Triglia from Peninsula Chiropractic going to be on. Going to talk to us about all things um, interesting. And uh, you can watch us, like I say, at WellerDoesDelmarva.com. We got lots of things to talk about. We realize this is our 60. It's amazing. So um, we appreciate that. Fran is back at the studio making sure everything works just perfectly and thank you Fran for doing that so anyway good morning everybody and um, it's a time of year you start turning your heaters on and making sure everything works and it's when you say uh oh I remember that wasn't working last year when I quit using my heater so uh, I wanted to mention one of my good sponsors which is First Class Heating and Air and they do heating and air conditioning work and this time of year I highly recommend that you consider this thought with them they have a maintenance program encouraging words are very affordable but how it works is they come out once or twice a year depending on what plan you buy and they service and check over your heater slash air conditioner to make sure everything's working just right and I think in the, towards the summertime they check the freon levels and all that and in the winter time I think they just check and make sure everything's operating to its optimum capabilities and if you get this service agreement not only do you get the two services a year or the one service a year, whichever you agree to, you also have the peace of mind of knowing that you're in their system. So if you have a breakdown or a problem, you give them a call. They already are familiar with what you have, where you're at, and they get, get right on you. But the other thing is that I also find interesting is you get a discount. So anything else you need or get done, whether it be labor or parts, whether it be to that heating and air conditioning system, or they also do plumbing, and they also do electrical, and they also do home performance systems, once you get that service agreement, that's you get it. You get the service agreement, but just as an added value bonus, no extra charge, you get discounts on any future services, parts, and labor. And I just find that amazing. So in other words... They're a real good company. I really like them. I've dealt with them quite a bit. Um, I've been promoting them now for quite a while, and they're just good people. So if you need a heating and air contractor, if you need some plumbing, or if you need some electrical work done, or if you need a home performance test, give them a call, 934-8900, 934 934- 8900 and they're on the web it's first just the word first class hvac.com tell them i sent you if you would really nice company to deal with so other than that we're here wellers will be open today at nine o'clock brooks is there any update on your brother brandon who's getting ready to have twins actually i think his wife is but um same thing yeah yes yeah, she went to the doctor yesterday okay the labor process is starting okay so once, once what's the- that mean well, once she starts, be more specific. To, like, <laughs> I don't think she would want me to be. <laughs> uh, okay. But she, um, once she starts contracting, they're gonna they're gonna go ahead and, and do the C section. So. Okay. So is your prediction before the first of the year? Oh, absolutely. Oh, well, absolutely. Yeah, it's scheduled. Doctor to, Brooks. At, at the latest, at, to be the thirtieth. So oh, okay, it okay. The 30th, it'll oh, be the so that's how you can comfortably say absolutely before the first of the year. That's correct. My okay. my guess would be sometime early next week, Tuesday. Early Wednesday. next that's, week. That's what I'm guessing. Really? Yep. So Brandon's not going to be around. No, probably not. Probably wow, not. he's going to miss all this. And I think they're hoping for not tomorrow, uh, because tomorrow is big day at church. Uh, well, it's, it's my my daughter's birthday. Oh, okay, so, okay, okay, okay. I got you. Okay. So they're they're wanting it to they they don't want them to have the same birthday because then right. you know if we have Somebody a family feels get together left out. Yep. exactly. So wow. But, uh, well, either way, it's going to be. It seems like December is a big a uh, big month for the Ritter family. Why? <laughs> oh, I got. We got anniversaries. Okay. My marriage anniversary. Oh, okay. And then we also got my my daughter's birthday. Okay. And then, well, I guess not December, maybe November, December, because then well, my whole wife's family, pretty much everybody, really? just about everybody in the so family. So it's a busy, is, busy time. It's a birthday, yep. And then right after that is, or in the middle of that is Christmas. Exactly. And then New Year's. Yeah. Wow. 
exciting times around here. It, it is. It is. It's a lot. Well, well, that's good. That's uh, the update on the Ritter babies that are coming along. Have they named them? They have. Better not say it on the air. Yeah. Because they're minors. <laughs> <laughs> I better not because I don't want to mix them up. Uh, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Even though presumably they're both going to be born at the same time. Yeah, yeah. But they they, right. ha they have them named. They know okay. which one is which as far as where they're located. So Okay. So it's going to be very uh, crucial to the doc doctor to when. Oh, you know, to not get them mixed up. Yeah, when they pull which one out because, you know, they based them on how they move and stuff uh, like okay, that. Okay, so, okay. Yeah. Well, that would be like Brandon, very technical. Yeah. You know, don't sit here, don't stand there. <laughs> Okay. All right. Well, it's a good thing he's not up this early, right? Sure. Hey, I found today's date very interesting. 12, 13, 14. It's the last time we'll have something like that. This week? In years? Yeah, there you go. I just guessed at that. Some, it's 80-something years. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's, wow. I think and why is that? Based on how the dates fall. They said the next time it'll actually happen is like 1, 2, 3. So in 2103. Is the next time it'll happen January second of twenty one oh three. Really? So next time you'll have uh, sequential numbers. Like I doubt that. I'm going to be here. You'll be doing that uh, show alone. I don't know. I mean, I'll be. That would put me at a, what, a like a hundred and nineteen or something like yeah. that. Yeah. I don't We're going to both have to work on our eating. Yeah. <laughs> for a lot. That to <laughs> and I don't mean eat more. No. A big wrestling event. Is it wrestling or wrestling? It's wrestling. Wrestling. Yes. Wrestling. <laughs> okay, I got some tickets to a wrestling event coming up. Um, it's actually, when's December 13th? Um, today. Today. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So these tickets are for tonight. Doors open at 5, okay? So I'll tell you more about it in just a little bit. How are we going to give these away? What is your suggestion? They can uh, go online and watch the stream and chat with me there. Oh, really? They can text me. Can text somebody you. chat with you on the stream? They can, yep. So you're going to work all them knobs and buttons and chat? Oh, yeah. I mean, there's three computers over here. <laughs> okay. You going to turn any of them on today? Uh, probably not. <laughs> okay. All right. But they're there keeping you company. They are. All right. So we're going to have a giveaway there. And um, what do they need to do? Just chat with you? Just go online and chat with Brooks and you can win a ticket? Absolutely. Sounds good to me. This is a $20 ticket. Little Caesar sponsors this. So um, big pizza, event. Pizza, pizza. Pizza, pizza. All right, folks. You are listening to Weller Does Delmarva. And we got a lot going on. I mean, a lot. Um, I do want to mention another neat place that we have been. You like this place. Um, I think we call it Shore Speed. Is that correct? That's correct. All right. And Shore Speed is located right in Milford. Now, how would you describe where it's at, Brooks? I would say if the easiest way to get to it is if you know where McDonald's in Milford is. Okay. If you were to go back towards like NKS distributors, there's a big okay. circle back there. It kind of just loops all the way around. Exactly. So, so you can go right or left at that point. That's correct. And they're basically – Opposite side of McDonald's, but okay. about that area. Okay. And it's a huge building. Huge building. I would use the word humongous. Yeah, absolutely. And if you're looking at the building, there's like where the doors are, there's like, you know, like headers and stuff. Right. And they're checkered flag. Oh, that's right. Yep. So it's very. But what it is, is, what it is, is an indoor go-kart track. Mm-hmm. And um, you and your brother have gotten hooked, uh, hooked, hooked, addicted, whatever you want to call it. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely, folks. And um, <laughs> they are, they're not gasoline. They're battery operated. Do you think they really go 40 miles an hour? Honestly, I'm not sure, but it feels like Do it. Do they claim 30 to 40 or 40 to 50? I believe they say 30 to 40. 30 to 40. Yeah. Okay. I mean, uh, it, it so to exaggerate like, it, I could say 40 to 50. Absolutely. Okay. <laughs> Either way, it feels like you're moving at the speed of light. Sure. And, and it's a flat track, so it's not like. That's right. So, I mean, They're not four-wheel drive go-karts. No. <laughs> but, but you see some tracks that kind of have that, you know, have like a bank right. to them. Right. To where you, you feel more speed. I mean, you, or you're not feel more speed. You can go faster all the way around. But, but when you're going, I mean. You feel like you are flying. And really, being a flat track, you've really got to watch how you drive because otherwise you go slide right into the little railing. Ex exactly. Right. So yeah. you got to know when to brake and when to turn and, and when to lean on the guy next to you if you have to. and Sure. Don't run over him and so on and so forth. So if you've never been, folks, I don't know their exact hours, but I'm going to tell you this. Number one, they're on Facebook. What is it? Just your speed? It's a likes page on Facebook. Really appreciate it if you just take a minute and go to their page and like them. Keep up with all the different things they got going on. We've had a birthday party there. We've rented it one night a month. 
we've spent a lot of time there, and we have a lot of fun. They have things for little kids, big kids, adults, a little bit of everything. So if you've never been to Shore Speed, I highly recommend you check them out. Um, just a good afternoon of fun. I think they're open on Sunday afternoons and some evenings and stuff like that. Just going out with a family or a good father-son or mother-daughter thing or father-daughter thing or however you want to work it. But anyway, it's called Sure Speed. I'm going to give you their phone number in case you have any questions. It's 362-7113. 362-7113. But if you would, like their page on Facebook. They're on Maston Circle in Milford, Delaware, Indoor Go-Kart Track and Family Adventure Area. You could actually literally, literally, literally rent it and have a birthday party there or something like that. Okay, so we got some tickets. We're going to just literally give these away. Is that okay? Sure. This is called the 1CW Pro Wrestling Hall of Fame Night. Uh, Delaware Auto Exchange is where it's at. That's right up on the highway in Felton. That's a really neat place. You can go up there. I think it's Thursday nights, and uh, they sell, like, Hundreds and hundreds of cars just move through that place. It's really neat. And I think the public and um, dealers go there, and it's just a great place to get a car or get a good deal, hang out. They've also got a food vendor trailer in there that has really good hamburgers. And so it is tonight from 5. Um, the door opens at 5, and the bell time is at 6 o'clock. It's going to be a lot of fun. If you've never been, I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 tickets right here in my hand, okay? So what is the deal going to be? They just chat with you and say, Brooks, I would like one ticket. Sure. Is that is How can we make it more complicated than that? They can go to Facebook, the Weller Does Dumb Lava, like us, and also post a, a message. they got to do it well. on our likes page. How yeah. about we do it that I like way? That. I like that. Scrap but that chat idea. <laughs> sure. They can chat with him. Anybody chatted with you yet? Stan, uh, Stan Myers. Chan uh, Who's Stan, Stan Myers? Stan That's Stan the fan, Stan not the Stan fan. the man. Stan the fan. Stan the fan. Good morning, Stan. Um, if you're watching... I got my hair situation straightened out. <laughs> anyway, um, so anyway, they would need to go and like our Facebook page and post some kind of a message. Yep. Okay. Can I talk about this thing? I bet we don't got it on our website yet. I don't think we do. Don't got it. <laughs> what kind of language is that? Anyway, folks, this is hot off the press. It's the Weller's Walls discount card. Okay. Colin Walls and myself put this card together, and what it is, it's a discount card. Now, it's good now, and it's good all the way till 1231 of 2015, that's okay? All, that's over a year. That's over a year, and listen to what you get. They're $15 each. I'm going to have a special here in just a minute, but let me tell you what you get. First of all, you get at Applebee's, and this would be what Applebee's? Milford, Rehoboth, Seaford, 10% off excludes alcohol, tax and gratuity. Well, there's no tax that I know of, but anyway... 10% um, off at Applebee's, Burgers and Beans in Milford, another great place. They got great burgers, great, great milkshakes, too, mm -hmm. and great French fries, okay? Anyway, 10% off. Bethany Blues, 10% off. Then we got Alfredo's Pizza Gallery in Seaford. This is a crazy offer, okay? Large cheese pizza, $7.99. Wow. That's a wow one. Yeah, that is. Abbott's Grill in Milford. Now, we're really happy with Abbott's Grill, aren't we? Oh, yeah. Just at our Christmas party there the other night. And it was they did a great evening. job. I mean, that we had one gentleman wait on us, gentleman server, whatever you want yeah. to. That, he worked hard. Yes, he did. I don't <laughs> know how many of us group. there was, but yeah. I took a picture of the table. And fortunately, we were able to order from the menu. That was neat because yeah. we had our company Christmas party there. And they allowed us to order from the menu, so everybody got what they want. I got this big crab cake. It's, did you get the exact same thing? Yeah, I got the same crab cake. Yeah. Okay. But did I see somebody got meatloaf? Yeah, Jason got meatloaf. Man, that looked big and thick and juicy. I mean, that was some good-looking meatloaf. Yeah, they brought that out. I'm like, man, that looks like service for two. It did, didn't it? <laughs> yeah. But everybody's plate was so good. It came out hot. It came out quickly. Abbott's Grill did a wonderful, wonderful job for us. So that's not even an Abbott's Grill commercial, folks. But I'm just letting you know they did a great job for us. But they're on our discount card, 10% off, okay? Um, then you got Mama Maria's in Milford, 10% off. So think about this, folks. You buy this card for $15. And you use it all year long. Can you imagine? You could probably save a couple hundred dollars with this thing. Yeah, you'll, you'll pay for it in the first right, couple of You go out and, and, you know, your family, and, and it's a $25, $35 meal. You're saving $2, $3 every time, mm -hmm. you know. Um, then you've got Nicola Pizza, another big favorite, 10% off, okay? Oh, my goodness. That's on dine-in or carry-out. That's a real good deal. That's a real good deal because usually the discounts are only on dine-in. 
So that's Nicola Pizza on the First Street, Rehoboth Beach. Then you got Hardee's, Milford, Harrington, and Dover. Listen to this one. Buy one, get one free. Any thick burger. That's, that's, a, that's, that's a huge bargain. That's a, huge, that's a huge bargain, yes. Blue Water Grill, they're back open. They had had a fire a while back. Great place to eat. Um, 10% off. Dairy Queen in Milford. This is a real good one. I love it because I'm going to take my grandkids and stuff. A um, dollar off a blizzard, but not the large one. A dollar off any size blizzard. Wow. That's a wow. So, you know, if you take your kids or something like that and you're not, because usually you would think the dollar would be off the largest one. They're yeah. giving you a dollar off any size blizzard. So you can get that little mini blizzard, which is yes. only like a dollar ninety nine or something. So you get it yeah, like a dollar cents. off. Yeah. Wow. All right. Here's another great one. Folks, and this is the Weller Walls discount card, and they're only $15. And when I'm done with going through it, I'm going to also offer you a great special. There is a picture of it on the Jim Weller Facebook page. you got to go to Jim Weller. I posted a picture sometime yesterday, and there's a picture of the front and the back. McDonald's. This is only a participating McDonald's. Colin Walls tells me Milford does it for sure. Have you ever done it down here at this McDonald's? Yeah, you know? Bridge- Bridgeville, Bridgeville does it Okay. Yeah. All right. Buy one, get one free. Quarter pounder with cheese. Dang. I mean, that's a way to be a big hit with your coworkers. Man, that's Go like down and get one and bring another one back. And that's like a 3 or $4 value just Every in that time. One. Exactly. Every time. Here's another great one. Duck Inn Car Wash. They have a place now in Seaford. Yeah. So you've got Seaford and Milford. Okay? Mm-hmm. $3 off the Extreme Car Wash. $3. So, folks, what I'm saying is, this is a these are hand picked. I mean, we put a lot of effort into this card, as you could see, we did. In other words, um, and so they're fifteen dollars each. Okay, they're good for all of next year. But here's the special we got right now. We're going to drop the price to ten dollars, and if you want three of them, that'd be thirty dollars. Mm-hmm. I'm going to reduce that to twenty five. Wow. Yeah, That's just a, a little bit deal. over eight dollars a piece. Okay. So great, is that eight dollars or thirty? Oh my gosh! Great stocking stuffer, great gift for the neighbor, the mail person, the UPS driver, anybody you could think of. In other words, you know what a deal! It's the gift that keeps on giving all year long. Yep. It's the kind of thing: the more you spend, the more you save. Exactly. Right. I like that. So anyway, they are available at Wellers in Bridgeville and Wall Service Center in Milford. Ten dollars each. Three for twenty-five dollars. So the immediate question is, how much? Think about this now. How much is 12 of them? <laughs> Brooks. So that would be about four times the three. So that would be 100 bucks. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it only took me a few minutes. Okay. Good thing it wasn't an emergency. <laughs> That's why we don't open till 9 because my brain doesn't kick in until oh, is that what it is? about 845. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Folks, get them. Get them, get them, get them, get them. We do only have a few, uh, but they are good for all of next year, and they're really nice, and we're really Please. I haven't seen it yet. I'm going to have to go wrestle. That, All right. That would be a show worth paying. Would it really? <laughs> yes. Yeah, I'd be winded in being involved with the show. Um, I think they've been on about a year now. Just talked to them the other day. They said, hey, Jim, we're going to stay on your show just about as long as you do your show. So anyway, l w Insurance Agency has been my insurance agent for years and years and years and years. I really is not price because I have a mental belief. This is Jim Weller's belief. That all insurance is the same no matter where you buy it, the price, because it's set by the insurance companies. So when one somebody is cheaper than another somebody, I immediately would question that. I would say, what's missing? And, you know, the only person that's going to know what's missing is the agent that's selling it to you. So I like l w for this main reason. They're friendly. When I have a problem, I deal with them. I don't have to deal with the insurance company. Now, I can deal with the insurance company if I want. But I would really rather them to be the voice between me and the insurance company. And they represent many different insurance companies. So whether you need auto insurance, health insurance, life insurance, commercial coverage, and so on, give them a call. One call does it all. 856-7828. 856-7828. And you say to yourself, I already have insurance. That's great. But it would sure be worth getting a second opinion. Second opinions are free. Sometimes they're worth a lot. Sometimes they're not worth as much. But it's well worth checking out that you're properly covered because there's nothing worse than getting a really good deal. And then when you need your insurance, finding out, oh, my goodness, I wasn't properly insured. That's why it was cheaper. 
So anyway, eight them a call on the web. It's lwinsurance.com. Good people. I really like them. I hope they like dealing with me. We have a lot of things and a lot of insurance, and um, they do a good job for us. So um, LNW Insurance Agency. Now, what do I want to talk about next, Brooks? Well, I did want to throw a Delaware sports. Delaware sports. Uh, you are doing something? I, well, I, I love sports in general. Okay. But Wesley football will yep. be on ESPN3 today at noon. So are you commentating that? I will not be commentating that. Is that the right I word? I don't know if I can talk fast enough. Oh, really? <laughs> to be a sports announcer. Especially before eight forty-five in the morning. Well, that, that, that's about lunchtime, so you know I might be actually you know in my groove at that point. But lunchtime is eight forty-five in the morning. What no, are you talking no, about? Till noon when the when oh it's when it's on. Okay. But uh, I just wanted to shout that out there because I, I love seeing uh, you know local s- sports. On the national television. That's going to be cool, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. We need to go get some big Weller shirts and be in the crowd and running around. <laughs> go, go running across the field. Right, running across. <laughs> and I'll chase you. <laughs> we'll both get winded halfway across. Yes, we would. <laughs> I haven't mentioned this in a while. We have an email special list where Brandon's always mailing out some specials on uh-huh. the email. And I just want to let people know it's free to get on that list. There's no charges there. No. No application fee? No application None at fee. all. So if you want to be on our email special list and you can opt out at any time, but some of the specials he sends, you can only get them if you're on the email special list. Send him a note. It's Brandon at Wellers.com. Folks, I'm going to take a brief break, and I'll be back. You're listening to Weller Does Del Marva. Stay tuned, log in, and watch us online while we're on commercial break. We'll be right back. Catch up when you wake up. Dan Gaffney, you got to listen to Dan. You need this watch. <laughs> Absolutely. So on Monday. So Local topics, local conversation. We're going to have an hour with Ella Adele. We does it again. It's not finger pointing. It's not virtual. Gerald Morris. We go on the news 3 till 7. He totally cracks me up. My class. Live and local all day, every weekday. Thank you for making the switch. And for calling the Delaware 1059. Partly cloudy skies for tonight, low 33. Mostly sunny and breezy for tomorrow, high 44. Tomorrow night, clear, low 34. Clouds and sunshine on Sunday, high 46. Mostly sunny on Monday, high 50. And for Tuesday, partly sunny with some showers, high 54. I'm Andy Rob in the Delaware 1059 Weather Center. Be sure to listen to Dave Jones from Atlantic Refrigeration and Air Conditioning this Thursday at 11.30. Call during the Susan Monday Show, and Dave will be happy to answer any of your heating and air and geothermal questions. Find out how you can upgrade your home to be energy efficient this Thursday at 11.30. Over 2,700 years ago, the prophet Isaiah penned these words. The grass withers, the flower fades, but the word of our God will stand forever. Much has happened since these words were written. Kingdoms and empires have come and gone. Generations of people have lived and died, but the Word of God still stands. Hi, this is Pastor Dwayne Smith from Sussex County Bible Church in Harbison, Delaware, and I would like to invite you to join us for our weekly radio broadcast, The Voice of Truth, as we study the unchanging truth of God's Word each Sunday morning at 8 a.m. right here on Delaware 105.9. For your first time in the first state in the USA, we're WXDE, Lewis. Same as news update, I'm Gary Nye. It'll be a weekend to clean up and dry out through much of the West Coast after a brutal Pacific storm. CBS's John Blackstone is in Northern California. It wasn't absorbed in the ground as well, particularly in areas with reservoirs. Uh, in the Marin County uh, area, where about six inches of rain fell uh, in 24 hours, uh, the reservoirs there are now almost full. Camarillo Springs, northwest of Los Angeles, was the site of a wildfire last year that denuded vegeta- vegetation, leaving exposed soil that has eventually now turned into mud. Frank Zelinski was asleep. Ten o'clock, we got a call from the sheriff. Two o'clock, the fire up and rang our bell, told us to get out. We said, no, we're going to stay. At three o'clock, the fireman rang our bell. And so put your light on and get out. In Ventura County Fire Captain Mike Lindbury. Apparently when the mud rocks came in, it moved some furniture and pinned them in their bedroom. We had firefighters break down the door, move in, remove them all safely, uninjured. CBS News Update, I'm going on. 
Take Delaware 105.9 with you everywhere by streaming us on your smartphone or tablet. Download the Delaware 105.9 Listen Live app in the Apple App Store or Google Play Store today. Utility trailers new and used, as well as sheds, carports, gazebos, dog kennels, and swing sets. Give them a call at 302-337-8228 or on the web at dwellers.com. On air, on demand, and on your device. Delaware 105.9. The Park Place Jewelers holiday tradition continues, giving you the best gifts of love and memories. At Park Place Jewelers, choose from sparkling diamonds, gemstones, gold, and silver, to engagement rings, and so much more. And in keeping with Park Place Jewelers' Christmas tradition, if it snows one inch at the Ocean City Airport on New Year's Eve day between noon and midnight, Park Place Jewelers' friends and satisfied customers came so close to having their Christmas gifts for free last year when it snowed one inch the day after New Year's that you have nothing to lose at Park Place Jewelers. You'll get the special items you want to give as gifts at great prices, and you may even get your money refunded. Making your holidays just that much brighter. Park Place Jewelers at the White Marlin Mall, Route 50 West Ocean City, and on the boards between 2nd and 3rd Streets. The Park Place Jewelers put a sparkle in your Christmas this year. Looking for jewelry, Get into the holiday spirit by joining me, Sumo, at the Cottage Cafe in Bethany Beach on Thursday. I'll be broadcasting live there from 10 until 3, and I've got lots of great guests lined up, including some local musicians. Perhaps we'll get into some Christmas caroling and lots of great giveaways. So come for lunch and enjoy the made-from-scratch dishes at the Cottage Cafe, and then hang out and be part of the conversation and festivities this Thursday from 10 to 3 at the Cottage Cafe in Bethany Beach. Broadcasting live from Gilbert America's Christmas showroom inside Johnny Janosik's World of Furniture in Laurel, Delaware, today from 11 to 1. Started in piano lessons, or if you always wanted to play but think it's too late to learn, you need to call in or come see Touch and Hear those amazing new Yamaha pianos with pricing and deals you'd expect to find at Johnny Janosik. Experience the Yamaha Disco Hall Player Piano streaming over 30 music stations and year round holiday channels playing 24 7. All controlled from your iPad or iPhone. Bring live concerts from around the world right into your home. Parkland, Barry Manuel, Alicia Keys, and many more. Stop by or call into the Jared Moore Show today from 11 to 1 for the grand opening of Keyboard America's Christmas Showroom located inside Johnny Genesis World of Furniture in tax free Laurel, Delaware. I'm Carl Winley. Over the past year, our family had to come to grips with the fact that our mom needed to be in a nursing home. Mom and dad worked hard, and the thought of spending their life savings was devastating. The information we had was confusing and contradictory. Then a friend told me if I wanted good advice, I should contact an elder. Hi, I'm Michelle Persino Wells, and a few years ago, it became apparent to me that many families in Southern Delaware were facing the same difficult burden of how to pay for the cost of long-term care without losing all they had worked hard to earn. My partner, Amber Woodland, and I set out to gain the knowledge and affiliations to legally and ethically provide families, just like Carlisle's, with sound advice. At Persino Wells and Woodland, we focus on elder law issues, and more specifically on asset protection planning. Call us so we can help plan today to protect your families tomorrow. For more information, visit pwwlaw.com with offices in Seaford and Lewis. The comments, views, and opinions expressed on the air at Delaware 105.9 are those of the hosts, callers, and guests, and not those of staff, management, or advertisers at Delmarva Broadcasting Company. The following program is a paid commercial presentation. The comments, views, and opinions expressed do not necessarily reflect the views of the staff, management, or advertisers of Delaware 105.9. Okay, that was a quick break. So we are back. Weller does Delmarva, folks. And um, I do want to let you know that we are looking for places to do the show from. So if you own a business or you got an event coming up, um, we do need to be compensated something for our time and talents and efforts. I don't know about the talents, but for our time. <laughs> we're going to put in time either way, right? Absolutely. And um, this show is a show that we pay for. This is Weller does Delmarva. But uh, we, we work cheap, we work for food, and we even work for trade. So anyway, if you have a business that you would like us to come and do a remote at on a Saturday morning and stir things up for you and get your name out there, uh, we did one recently up there at Shore Speed 
Milford and had some people come out. A lot, a lot, a lot to talk about. Uh, if you want one of these 1CW Pro Wrestling tickets, I'm going to give you two thoughts. You can go to Weller Does the Marvin, like the page, or you could just give Brooks a call. Can you give him your cell phone number? You'd rather not. No, that's fine. All that's, right, go ahead. It's 448-0049. 448-0049. Just call Brooks Ritter and say, hey, I'll take one of those tickets absolutely free. It's a tonight event. So that is all. So, so folks, respond now, okay? Absolutely. The Weller Walls discount card, uh, I'm going to let you know that you can go to uh, Jim Weller's Facebook page, and I posted it yesterday sometime on there if you want to see what it looks like. We'll get it on wellers.com sometime. We just haven't got to it. We had mentioned today's date was rather interesting, 12, 13, 14, and we've got a busy week ahead of us. Also, Brooks, i got a question for you. Sure. Uh, do we still have any of these? I mentioned it last week. It's okay to say Merry Christmas. So many, But we do say it here at Wellers, and we want you to know it's not against the law to say Merry Christmas to people, okay? In other words, it's just against some people's beliefs to wish people Merry Christmas. So at Wellers, we're going to wish you Merry Christmas. We celebrate Christmas, and we want to let you know that we have a little button that says it's okay to say Merry Christmas. And we used to sell them, and this year we're literally just giving them away. Sure. So do we have any left? We have a few. A few. And yep. then we have this one sitting on my desk. Yep. <laughs> But they, so when, they have been very well received. Very We've well had received. Quite a few people to come in and get. There some. you go. And yeah. do they have to purchase anything? They don't have to purchase anything. They just need to come through the door and say, "Where's Brooks Ritter? Yep. I want one of them buttons." Absolutely. And it wouldn't um, hurt to walk around because you would be amazed. Are they allowed they to walk to, around? Absolutely. And are they allowed to spend money? Yeah, I guess so. Dag nab it, we'll let them, right? <laughs> yes. Man, our showroom is full. It you is. Have to it's be got careful. all kinds of stuff in there. Yep. All right. Uh, we are out of the bunk bed business, right? Yes, they okay. are gone. They are gone. <laughs> Anyway, uh, George Luff's another one of my good sponsors and good friend. I just talked to him the other day, and um, he does all our accounting. Luff & Associates, they have an office in Dover. They have one in Rehoboth, and they have one in Milford, and they're really good people to deal with. I've dealt with them for 20-plus years, and uh, they also do our payroll. That's one of the big things. You know, it's like when you have an accountant, you're like, you really appreciate them, blah, blah, blah. They do a good job, blah, blah, blah. You're happy until, oh, my goodness, I'm getting audited. Then you panic, okay? In other words, we went through a big old audit. It and uh, we didn't owe any money. No money was owed us, but we didn't owe any money. And that's when we really saw the fact that we do have good accounting. So we appreciate George Luff and his staff. But now he does our payroll. And so he takes care of all that mess. Them I-9s and W-3s and W-2s and W-4s and the 940s and the 941s and, and all that mess. So anyway, if you have a business, whether you got one or two employees or 10 or 20 employees or 120 employees, Luff... Friendly people, on time, on target, they do a good job. One phone call gets you to every office, 422-9699, 422-9699. They are on the web at Luff, L-U-F-F, C-P-A's dot com. They must be doing something right. I got a Why? paycheck yesterday. You did? Yeah. Well, you got to make sure it gets through the bank next. <laughs> hey, I want to tell you something else going on. I didn't plan on mentioning this, but I just saw a post on Facebook. My church that I go to is called Eagle's Nest down in Milton. I've been going there for years. Pastor Bob Weed does a great job there. And they have a group of people. Fundraisers they had was they got these seven-foot-tall Fraser fir Christmas trees, fresh cut and... Um, we bought one, got it up at our house. Jenny bought one, and lots of people have bought them. They're only $45, and they have a few left. And they also have some beautiful Christmas reefs, like a 16-inch reef, and they're only $25. If you happen to want one, they are a benefit. This is a fundraiser for their mission trip, and um, they are at the feed company. Now, a lot of people say, where in the world is the feed company? It's, um, it's there on the left. It's on the corner of Route 16 and Reynolds road in milton stop by today they're going to be there from 10 to 4 i don't know if they're going to run out or not i don't have a phone number for you so the bottom line is if you think you want one make your way there and either have 45 dollars or 25 dollars in your hand and you can get yourself a christmas tree or a wreath or for 70 dollars you can get a wreath and a christmas tree okay so that is today and today only at right there on the corner years and years and years ago Probably when you were just a little boy, Brooks, it used to be uh, Betts Hardware, I believe. Clyde Betts and Sons, I think mm -hmm. it was. So anyway, a lot has happened at that store, a lot of good things. So anyway, <clears throat> I hate to ask you this, another question, but you're out in the showroom a lot more than I am. The Holdy Poles. These are only available in the entire world 
at Weller's Utility Trailers in Bridgeville. And I say that all the time, and people say, how can you make such a statement? I can find them <laughs> things just anywhere. Well, let me tell you how I got them. I went to buy a forklift one day, and the man that had the forklift for sale said, you don't happen to want these things, do you? I said, what are they? He said, oh, there's some really neat, there, there, there's some brackets. And what you do is you fasten them to like if you have a basement and you've got some rafters or out in your garage, you got some rafters. These brackets fasten to the rafters and they come down and they're for hanging your fishing rods on. So you don't have to stand them on and you lay them across these brackets. And when you're done with your Christmas lights, you can wind them up and hang them from these brackets. Anyway, but the guy said, I've got all there is in existence because I bought this company out. And to get the machinery that I wanted, I had to buy all these holdy poles. <laughs> and he said, and then we broke the molds. So, um, and you could tell they're a little, they've been around a little while because the picture on the package is black and white. In other words, <laughs> just to give you an idea. In other words, but it's a holdy pole. It comes with the little screws and the nuts and bolts. Unused garage space provides good storage for fishing poles. Storage problems eliminated. Easy to reach. Now, that's quite a statement. I mean, if you're vertically challenged like I am, yeah, not. everything's <laughs> not easy to reach. Prevents damage to fishing poles, out of reach from children. Okay? So it's really neat how they package this. There's not a barcode or anything on this thing because it was probably before barcodes existed. <laughs> but they're brand new. They're blister packed. They're beautiful. They were $19.97 each. And I have no idea how much they're on sale for. I'm thumbing through our ads as we speak. But they've got to be in there somewhere. Do you happen to know, Mr. Ritter? I'm not off the top of my head. Oh, uh, what about the bottom of your head? <laughs> Any part of your head. Do you happen to know how much the holdy poles are? No. Dag on it, folks. I'm stumped. All right. I'm going to have to come back to you on that. I can't find them anywhere. But we have them. And if you have a question, why don't you just call who's out there? Jason? Jason is out there, yeah. All right. Let's just put Jason on the spot. 337 Eight two two eight three three seven eight two two eight. I cannot find them. Oh, I feel almost embarrassed, but not quite. Anyway, three three seven eight two two eight. If you want to know how much a holdy pole is, um, I cannot find them anywhere. I give up. Okay, I'm going to move on to the next thing. All right. We can just make a deal on them. What kind of deal you want to make? What if the deal out there is better than our deal? Then they can get the other deal. <laughs> okay. Well, what kind of deal you want to make there, Mr. Ritter? How about one? Now that you're put, trying to put me on the spot. Oh yeah. How about one for seven fifty, uh -huh. or, or two for ten? I'm gonna do you one better. I'll give you three for ten. Wow, that's a deal. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, and that simplifies it. I know the deal is not any better than that. Sure. So one for seven hundred and fifty dollars. Seven dollars and fifty cents. Okay, one for seven dollars and fifty cents. Or three for ten. Three for ten. Now, how long is that deal gonna last? Let's make it today. Let's make it end at eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. All right. How Tonight about seven forty-six? Okay. <laughs> Uh, 1 o'clock p.m. today. All right. For real? Yeah. All right. Three for ten. They make great stock at stuffers. They do. And the good thing about it is, is nobody's going to say, I've already got one of these. Exactly. <clears throat> okay. Yep. All right. That's the deal. You better write that down because I will forget it. Okay. And then you'll blame me. <laughs> and then I'm going to blame you because you're the closest mm. one to me. Hey, I want to talk about Wilson's Auction. A lot of people know I love to go to auctions, okay? And Wilson's Auction is located right on Route 113 in Lincoln City, Delaware. Dave Wilson and his group do a great job there. You know, on Tuesday nights, they have a really neat car auction. And then on Saturdays, they have a huge auction. It starts like 10 o'clock in the morning. There's stuff outside. There's stuff inside. And you can go there. Six or seven o'clock Saturday night, and they're still auctioning stuff off. So, if you enjoy a good auction and you have fun buying stuff at auction, or if you got some stuff you want to sell, you can literally take consignments down there through the week and drop it off. Or if you have a whole building full of stuff you want sold and you want them to come to you, maybe you need something appraised, maybe you've got a car you want to get rid of, maybe you want to go there on Tuesday night and buy a car, it's Wilson's Auction. Located right on Route 113 in Link 422-3454 is the number. And um, they have a lot of stuff on the web. It's wilsonsauction.com. Tell them I sent you. Really good people to deal with. But listen to this. January 1st, whatever day that is. What day is January 1st? A Thursday? Yes, I believe so. I it can is. Tell you for it sure. is. Yeah. Anyway, um, 
that's uh, New Year's the things they're going to have is some low digit tags. I always like that. But um, they have a lot of stuff, antiques and um, all kinds of interesting things. It's quite a little gathering. So if you got something you want to sell, try to get it in for that auction. That's Wilson's Auction, Route 113 in Lincoln, 422. 30 you bid is what you pay. I really like that. Dave Wilson is quite pleased that he is not, you know, charging you more than what you bid. Uh, some auction companies do, but he wants me to let people know that at Wilson's, what you bid is what you pay. You know, I'm going to jump to that in just a minute, but i got to ask you, Brooks. We bought these tablets. These are a brand-new 7-inch Android tablet. We bought a few hundred of them, yep. okay? Mm -hmm. I tried to buy thousands, and they ran out before I could make up my mind quick enough, <laughs> which is odd. But they come in four colors. Yes. What color is the most popular? Pink. Get out of town. Pink, but I would say by, by twice, like double. Really? Yeah. So what are the colors? Pink, and then blue is the ne is the next. These at Weller's colors, or is this a nationwide study? <laughs> they they're the ones that came up with the colors, so I okay. would say it's probably a nationwide thing. But okay, I mean I would assume that blue and pink would be your two most popular colors. But do you notice none of them are black? No. Isn't that something? Yeah, and, and I think they're trying to aim it towards. You know, younger crowd, a younger crowd, and to make it look different. Okay. But they do; they look they look different. If you look and see a lot of tablets, there's a lot of black tablets. There so, is, isn't there? So they're trying to. I Can I hand this to out. you? Sure. I want you to keep talking while I take my headphones off and turn the heat down. <laughs> okay, no okay. problem. But it's a seven-inch tablet. It is uh, Android. So if you're used to, uh, you know, an Android phone. Um, it, it'll operate pretty much very similar. A lot of the same apps that you have on your phone, you can put on the tablet itself. It has a camera on the front and on the back. It has. Uh, you mean the camera's technology. glued to it? No, it's built in. Oh, it's it. built in. <laughs> yep. Does it have a speaker built in? Yes, it has a built-in speaker. I can't well. remember what I had one time, but I had something. I couldn't listen to the daggone thing. That's no Without good. earbuds or whatever, you know? That's no okay. good at all. Can I talk about the bundle? So sure. first of all, you could buy this tablet right now on sale. Uh, for what, seventy seven fifty? Seventy seven fifty. Okay, so we've got it reduced down pretty good and they're brand new in the box. Okay. Yep. Full manufacturer's warranty. Yep. Okay. So next thing is we have a bundle. Is that what we call it? A That's bundle. Correct. Yep. All right. So uh pretty high end, you know, components for electronic equipment. And they have a really nice little cleaning kit. Yes. Is that right? What is it like a spray bottle it's with like a, a foam cleaner. little um foam cleaner and stuff yep. like that? So you can literally clean your tablet or your cell phone or laptop or your laptop or, or whatever. Yeah. Okay. Then you get a set of these earbuds. They're called juicy earbuds. Is that right? That's correct. Comfort earbuds. All right. And they're new, not used. New. Brand new. Brand in new the package. In the package. You can right. see they are clean. So we got basically we got the um, seven inch tablet. Mm -hmm. We got the Zag cleaning kit. We got the earbuds. Is that right? That's correct. The next thing is. This what would you call this? A case? It's a keyboard case. Keyboard case because yeah. I noticed when you open it up, yep. it has a keyboard built right into it. That's correct. That's kind of neat. Yep. So anyway, it's a case. It's the cleaning kit. It's the earbuds and it's the tablet. And we're selling it all as a bundle. Is that yep. correct? All for one money. Okay. So what? Like 100 quarter, 140 something like. 97.50. Are you sure? Because I know that was the sale price. 97.50. 100 percent. I would put my employment on the line. Well, you could be saying <laughs> for seventy-seven fifty they get the tablet, yep. but for just twenty bucks more they get the cover, the cleaning case, and the earbuds. That's correct. I mean, in, okay. in the case itself, you know, sells for about twenty bucks. So you're getting, you know, that you're getting, you're getting the, the case, other stuff free, the earphones and the cleaning kit. Okay. For for twenty dollars. Ninety-seven fifty. Now, where are these available at? These are available at Wellers in Bridgeville. And who should they talk to? They should talk to Brooks. Earl. Brooks. <laughs> Earl is doing a good job out there, folks. I haven't had anything. Get Brooks on his toes. Even the ballet lessons I sent him to did not get him on his toes. Anything like Earl has. Yeah, we got a good team out there. Uh, ain't no doubt. Yeah. I mean, we are doing good. And if you haven't been to Wellers.com lately, there's a mess of good ads on there. Yeah, there is. Mess of good. So, anyway, there's a mess of good ads on there. Click on, is to say, what, current ad on there? Yes. Are the sale prices on there? They should be. Should be? Mm -hmm. Okay. So if you are thinking about a trailer, the one trailer we are selling every day, almost one or two of them every day, okay, is this 599 trailer. Best deal in the northern United States. In other words, 599 bucks for a brand new 5x8 landscape trailer. And it's not like it's a 2010, 11, or 12. It's a fresh 2014 with a treated wood floor. 
$599. But we are having some year-end specials. They're going really, really good. We've had a great year. I want to say thank you to all the customers for that. Whether you've bought a tablet, a holdy pole, or um, a trailer or two, or come in and got one of these free buttons, thanks a lot. We really make our money on the free stuff, so uh, we, we want more of that. So um, we are here. We are going to be open at 9 o'clock today. It's Weller's Utility Trailers. Phone number is 337-8228, And uh, we will talk to you on the phone. On the web, it's wellers.com. Would love it if you would like our Facebook page. And, um, you know, a place I recently visited that I was very impressed with, okay? And it's hard for me to go to a business and be, like, really impressed. But right down the road, there's a place called That Granite Place. A guy named Mark Johnson owns it. I've gotten to know Mark real good here. He um, comes to Jimmy's Grill on Friday morning, and he's on Dan's show. And um, he's got this business called That Granite Place. And him and I have been talking, and I stop by, and I'm like, man, now I'm going home. And Denise is like, I wouldn't mind a granite butcher block. What's it called? A butcher block thing? Butcher, for, for cutting and stuff? Yeah. In other butcher. words, we have one. Went there, and they, I mean, me and Mark Johnson, we have something in common. We like to give our customers selection. Sure. And by that, I mean we have inventory. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Right by his place, he's got sheet upon 900 sheet 900 and sheet. some pieces in stock. Yeah. I mean, think about that. Mm -hmm. I mean, and what he showed me was he's got these great big slabs of granite out there, okay? Mm -hmm. And they, they are beautiful, some of them. I mean, they got these, I don't know if you call it a vein or a line or a groove or whatever you call it, running through it. But, like, if you go to him and you say, I really like that, they can make, you know, the one piece that attaches to the next, they can make that groove keep right on going. But I got to thinking, if a person doesn't have that amount of inventory, they may buy one piece where the groove is in this position, but then once the guy orders the next pieces, they don't match up. Because they're not like they're not in sequence. Numbers. Gotcha. Right. And that's what he's got going for him is he's got the inventory to be able to keep that groove or vein or whatever flowing right on through your countertop or your backsplash or whatever. Another thing I didn't know is let's say you're just a consumer. Let's just say my wife decides she wants to put granite countertops in our kitchen. She literally could go down there herself. She doesn't need a contractor to go with her. She doesn't even have to have her husband go with her. She's allowed to go all by herself, and they have a really nice showroom. For, they even have some things in stock. I don't know if they were vanity tops or kitchen. I mean, like where you could walk in and leave with it. Thinking about granite or marble or quartz, anything like that for your countertops or your vanities or whatever, I would encourage you, before you make a decision tractor you're dealing with, mention to them that you would like to check out that granite place and if you're a contractor and you're not already dealing with that granite place they're always looking for more contractors to you know sell their product to so it's bill um and their phone number is 337-7490 337-7490 they're on the web at that granite .com. nice friendly staff but you could go in there and know nothing as i did and become an expert which i now am all about granite. So anyway, that granite place in Bridgeville. You know who's going to be known next? Who's that? I'm all excited when I talk to him. I actually feel better just talking to him. Dr. T. Uh, he's a chiropractic, but they do massages. They have all kinds of wellness information. He's all about, you know, in other words, seeing what we can do to get your blood flowing better, get your brain working better, get your back into adjustment, make you walk straight and tall and be successful. Because the better you feel the better you do. What? Absolutely. I, I really got to pay attention when he comes in because... Uh, you fall asleep? No, well, oh. I, I, I need to go to a chiropractor. You do? I had a chiropractor, but yes. I haven't been in so long. I called to make an appointment, and, and they're like, we'd have to see you as a whole new... Like, you got to fill all the paperwork again, right. and all this. I'm like, well, if I'm going to do that, and I'm going to go see Dr. T. And what if you don't match up to the height and weight requirements? Because <laughs> Dr. T, every, when he's in here talking, everything's sad. Oh, you? my goodness. Oh, well, I can tell you from dealing there. I deal there. Denise deals. And here's another thing, and, and I don't want you to take this wrong. You and I have a very similar problem. What's that? <laughs> we have like this minor bowling ball right above in the our back mass. <laughs> in, in our center mass, and that puppy is pulling on us all day long, oh, okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, so anyway, um, he has to keep us straight. So he'll be here in a little bit, folks. If you've never heard from Dr. T, you're going to enjoy listening to him, listening 
to him. So, Brooks, what else you got on your mind? I want to give away some of these. <laughs> Can I talk about it in the next time? Sure. I want to give away the farm, folks, um, and watch what we do during the break. We'll be right back. There's a car accident in this country every five seconds. That's why Allstate thinks it's time for an entirely different kind of car insurance. With features like accident forgiveness and a safe driving bonus, it's called Your Choice Auto, and it's only from Allstate. Are you in good hands? Sign up for Your Choice Auto today. Call the insurance market at 800-999-7518 or visit insurancechoices.com. Features are optional and subject to terms, conditions, and availability. Patent pending. Allstate Property and Casualty Insurance Company, Northbrook, Illinois. You scour the papers for coupons and search for stores with the best sales. These days, we're all looking for ways to save any way we can. Allstate can help with cash back when you're a safe driver. You can get a safe driving bonus check every six months you're accident free. It's part of your choice auto, only from Allstate. With Allstate, you're in good hands. Start saving today. Call the insurance market at 800-999-7518 or visit insurancechoices.com. Feature is optional and subject to terms, conditions, and availability. Allstate Property and Casualty Insurance Company, Northbrook, Illinois. From the first town in the first state in the USA, we're WXTE Lewis. CBS News, I'm Gary Nunn. Santa has us when you pull in to top off your tank. Oil analyst Tom Closer says... You're going to see the cheapest Christmas since 2008. I think we'll average less than 250 and I think most people will be able to buy gasoline for between 199 and 229 The price of diesel dropping 30 to 40 cents. Heating oil 75 cents to a dollar cheaper than it was last year. Closer, the oil price information service says the gas prices are down because of oversupply. The AAA says today the price of a gallon of unloaded regular is averaging 257 nationwide. Crude prices fell 4% yesterday, now below $58 a barrel. A monster Pacific storm has moved eastward, impacting a wide area from Arizona to Idaho. Slides. KNX reporter Pete Demetrio in Camarillo. More than 150 homes were part of a mandatory evacuation during the rainstorm. With the rain came mud flows, and some homes didn't come through unscathed, according to Ventura County Sheriff's Captain Don Aguilar. And we're looking at about damage to about 15 homes, and 10 of those are red tagged at this time. They've got mud in them, and they're structurally unsafe. Yeah, we're not allowing any residents to go back in those places. Other streets in the community are still clogged with rocks ranging from fist to watermelon size. Another storm is drawing a bead on the region expected to hit first tomorrow in Northern California. Families of five black men will lead what's being called a march against racism and police profiling today in Washington. Today's march, organized by Al Sharpton's National Action Network, begins in Washington's Freedom Plaza and walks the mile to the U.S. Capitol. It was on the Capitol steps where, just 48 hours earlier, about 100 cannot don't shoot gesture. CBS's Mark Albert in Washington, another march expected today in New York City. The Senate will be gaveled into session today at noon, working on a procedural vote, among other things, to link to the $1.1 trillion bill that will keep the government operating through September next year. The House passed it, President Obama urging the Senate to approve it as well. Despite unwanted add-ons, Maryland Democratic Senator Ben Cardin says there are a number of good things in the bill. We provide an additional $5 billion plus to fight the Ebola crisis globally. This has a direct impact on the world economy, on world health and directly affects the United States. Republican leader Mitch McConnell says those on his side of the aisle are ready to vote now. There's no good reason not to. We're working to clear an agreement on our side to process the CR slash uh, omnibus, the extenders bill. Plans call for a final vote in the Senate on Monday. Supreme Court Justice Antonin Scalia joining the debate over the Senate's report on torture says it's difficult to rule out the use of extreme measures to get information if millions of lives are threatened. Scalia says American and European liberals who say such tactics may never be used are being self-righteous. This is CBS News. This is the sound of skiers in the backcountry. <laughs> and these are hikers out on a trail with their new gear from REI. Oh. At REI, we know you love the outdoors. And here's something else you'll love. 
great deals on outdoor gifts for the holidays. Save up to 30% on selected items each week, now through December 17th. Shop at your local REI or go to REI.com. All coughs aren't the same, and neither are all cough medicines. Robitussin's powerful dual-action formula relieves even the toughest coughs. Wet, <coughs> dry, <coughs> and hacking. <coughs> Fast, powerful Robitussin DM Max fights your cough and helps clear the congestion that comes with it. Robitussin, don't suffer the consequences. Use as directed. This week, stock up with special Robitussin bonus packs. Available at Walmart for a low price every day. Because the holidays are time for giving, CBS News correspondent Peter King has found one special giver in New England. An early Christmas present for Eastern Massachusetts toy buyers. An anonymous woman dubbed the Layaway Angel has paid off about $20,000 worth of layaways for 150 people. Employees at the Toys R Us store in Bellingham, Massachusetts, describe her as a bubbly older woman who gave the store manager a hug and said, Hey, if you have it, give it. Peter King, CBS News. Winner of college football's Heisman Trophy to be revealed tonight. Finalists are quarterback Marcus Mariota of Oregon, Alabama wide receiver Amari Cooper, and Wisconsin tailback Melvin Gordon. The longest-serving member of Congress in a Washington hospital, Michigan Congressman John Dingell admitted for observations had to be resting comfortably. It's unclear why. Dingell, who was 88, was admitted. He fell on Tuesday but showed up for House votes on Wednesday and Thursday. Join on CBS News. Hi, welcome to Hellsburg Diamonds. Hi there. Uh, we'd like to look at engagement rings. Uh, wait, is that the guy called Yeko? Oh, hello. I'm just admiring this lovely diamond solitaire ring. It's beautiful. Yeah, it is. Well, that was easy. Now, who thinks it's a good idea to save money on our car insurance? I do. I do. Wow. I think we just had the wedding rehearsal. Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. This holiday season, give the most eternal, unique gift of the year. Name a star after someone. I'm Rocky Moselle with International Star Registry. For $54 and a call to 800-282-3333 or visit StarRegistry.com, we'll name a star after anyone on your gift list. The star name will be recorded in book form in the U.S. Copyright Office, and we will send an incredible personalized gift package. Call the Star Registry, 800-282-3333 or visit StarRegistry.com for the gift that shines forever. is a paid commercial presentation. The comments, views, and opinions expressed do not necessarily reflect the views of the staff, management, or advertisers of Delaware 105.9. Man, that was a quick break. The break is over, Brooks. It the is over. The break is over, Brooks. Over, Brooks. Anyway, good morning, folks. You're listening to Jim Weller, the Weller Does Del Marva show. We're having a good time here. And um, I just want to let you know that um, Dr. T from down there, good morning to you. Why don't you talk right into that? Oh, yeah, I guess I better talk into the mic. Yeah, so it on your lap. yeah there you go. It won't work. Good, <clears throat> Good morning. Everybody. How was the drive up? Oh, beautiful drive up. Did you pass I, any donut places? Got, I passed several, <laughs> got, and I kept on passing them because, you know, uh, like my dad said, he wasn't too heavy. It was just too short. A minute on the lips. And it's worth a pound on the hips. Yeah. So, so uh, uh, yeah, we came up, and we, we were listening to you, and I passed uh, the granite place up here you're speaking about, and uh, they're, they're busting a move already this morning. Really? The trucks up there, and uh, so I guess that was Must what, be that advertising. The, the Weller Word got out, got out and they're just rolling. lined up down there. They are there. rocking. They got there before Man. I did. If you ever get time, no joke, yes. you ought to stop in there. Take your wife with you, too, because she that might, be like, dangerous. fall in love with some, gra- with I, some granite or something and say, she will. just got to have it. But I was quite impressed, and I, I like dealing with places that – that got oh, their I act love the together, local thing, know? and people yep. have, have their act together. Yes, yep. we will definitely so, be stopping by. So speaking of local, you're a local guy. I am. Uh, born and raised where? Born and raised, born in a house in Delmar, Delaware. Wow. Was at Delmar High School. Okay. And, what were your uh, grades like? Uh, horrible. Okay. Uh, yeah, they. Uh, my guidance counselor told me, actually, don't even apply to a college. Uh, you'll never make it through the front <laughs> door. So I wasn't a bad kid, but I think if they had me today, they would classify me as dyslexic, you know. Uh, so I was just didn't quite get it. But uh, then I was encouraged. Uh, I definitely was not ever going to go to school any further and work okay. at DuPont for the first summer. Okay. And after putting boxes together for three hours a day, I decided to move on. Really? Yeah. I, I thought there had a to little be boring better. for you. I thought there had to be a better way to make a living than in a big building with no windows and you have to work all night and days. And it had a cafeteria shit. though. It had a, the cafeteria was awesome. I, okay. I, you know, I've always been a great food man. <laughs> Being Italian background, you know, I love the food. 
right. So, uh, you know, Dell Tech graduate, and uh, again, I, I believe people in southern Delaware still have no idea what a great diamond we have in Delaware with Delaware Technical. And whatever small success I've had in life, I owe a lot to them because if wow. they hadn't started – uh, you know, I would have never gone. I had and, and even if they hadn't have been there, there would have been no other downstate. Oh, choice. yeah, there was no. I mean, that was it. And and wow. I remember the days when Jack Owens went around to the local Kiwanis and Rotaries and everybody was laughing at this fool who said they're going to put a college in southern Delaware, really? And, uh, yes, for, for whatever small success I've had, they have been, they're just a tremendous opportunity. Wow. For young people like me with no money, not a lot of, you know, college background or high school background. But they gave me an equal opportunity to become unequal, and that's what I think we all need today. To me, that's that's the fairness doctrine. Wow. So you did that, and now you're a chiropractor. Yes. Went on to Salisbury University, got my bachelor's degree, and uh, got to work for Uncle Sam for a few years. Got okay. top secret crypto clearance, worked in the military intelligence, really thought I was heading to the FBI, CIA kind of thing. And when I got back... Um, NSA actually was sending me some letters, but there was like a year waiting list. Okay. And I found out about this thing called chiropractic. I, see, I was older. I didn't know anything about it, good, bad, or indifferent. And then I got excited. I got turned on because I was always, you know, I, I had all my black belts in the martial arts, and I was big in the fitness, and I thought, boy, this you mean to tell me I could become a doctor without giving drugs or surgery? And again, we're not anti-drugs or surgery, but I like right. less, less 80 to 90%. See what we can do first. Let's try to keep people right. healthy. And so it made a lot of sense. So I visited Atlanta, Georgia, which is now the world's largest uh, chiropractic university. There's 26 of them across the country. Gosh. And uh, Life University is where I ended up going. I got very excited about it and graduated from there and lo loved it so much. My, my little kids, you know, when my, my daughters, my son, when they were little, you know, we'd be talking like this. My four-year-old daughter would come to me, Daddy, Daddy, I have a headache. Can you adjust me? Really? What did that little girl say? You know, my son would say, Daddy, I have a stomach ache. Can you adjust me? What? Yeah, yeah, hold on a minute. I'm going to go adjust them. So Gosh. it's not that we never use meds or anything, but 80 to 90% of the times I would adjust them because when you understand the central nervous system runs everything, right. and our job is to give life, you know. And, uh, you know, I made a deal with the good Lord a long time ago. I move the bone. He does the healing. works out awesome. Uh -huh. So, you know, he made it right. We just do stupid stuff throughout life. Like maybe let's have a little bit of um, anterior increase in benefits. <laughs> eating, overeating, yeah, not overeating, yeah, yeah. just <laughs> just, just eating, eating, eating yeah. over and over, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> not overeating, just eating over and over and all over. of us get there. So we do crazy things to ourselves, and our job is just to coach people. You know, it's not. I don't believe in this. Uh, you know, dub is to take what you need and rock on. So okay, we've been very, very fortunate. Could you help a young man like Brooks? Oh man, the young guys like them. I mean, truthfully, they respond so well once we get them on the path, and it's so simple. I mean, it doesn't take you know a long time. Uh, but m most of the time, people, we had just we had a lady the other day. She's probably in her early 60s, and um, she had been seeing another doc, great doc. I mean, does a great job, but for some reason, it just wasn't working out, and she had brought her daughter, granddaughter. And I'm drawing this picture, and, of course, my name is Michelangelo, but my daughter's always told me, Dad, you're a great doc. Please do not draw. <laughs> it's not, not a pretty picture. Especially in public. In public. Well, this... It was pretty enough for this granddaughter to get what I was telling her. And as the grandmother was watching, she said, that's exactly what I have. I'm about ready to see a surgeon. Can you help me? And I said, well, I don't know. We'll check you out. And praise God, by the first, the first visit, I mean, this woman is telling everybody all over. She has responded. She, she's a home care nurse. She couldn't. She has this um, very, very uh, invalid young lady that dead weight. She's got to help. And she couldn't even hardly lift up her arm, let alone her body. My goodness. After the first visit. I mean, it's not always like that, but we right. were, she was very blessed and could get up and get rolling again. You know, sometimes we do things to the body that are very over a very long time. So it takes a little while. You know, I say people from 20 to four, uh, at 60 come to me, no matter what it costs, get it fixed. But we destroy this body between 20 and 60, those 40 years, and want me to fix it in a day. So it's a little right. difficult. So, yeah, we've been very blessed. Now, I, we were talking uh, during the break, you know, and I suggested Brooks go once a month. Is that an unreasonable thought for somebody to consider going to a chiropractor once a month? People ask me that all the time. What, well, once I go, I always have to go, or is that true? Well, once you brush your teeth, you usually should always brush your teeth. Okay. And so, no, as long as you have no... keep that in mind. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> why, not, why not wait to exercise till after you have your first heart attack? You know, that's... So chiropractic is the same way. It's prevention... We find things many times before the symptom. Most of us are geared to symptoms. So I tell people you don't have to come at all if you have no stress in your life, like you guys have almost no stress. Correct. So, but, uh, <laughs> Unless we're near each other. <laughs> <laughs> Unless we're near each other. And stress can be good. I mean, it can be physical, mental, emotional, spiritual. You know, Brandon's getting ready to have the birth of these children. I mean, that's very high Stressful stress level. Stressful on him. 
Uh, so yes, stress creates what we talk about, this subluxation misalignment. So what we're allowed to do, what we're able to do rather, is to find these misalignments many times before they become major, major problems. Well, and then if it's a mental, we send you up here to Jim Weller to get an attitude adjuster. That's and right. We can, we can adjust Amish that. made. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, I'll tell you, my theory on chiropractic is almost like the same as the front end alignment of a car. You know, you know you're going to get down the road. It'll get where it's going to get, but it's going to not go as smooth and wear a little and so on. But I have found, even if I feel like I'm catching a cold or something like that, that it's worth just getting an adjustment because I guess I don't know if it's a mental thing or if it really makes a difference, but in my mind, I think if I can get my circulatory system working as optimum as it can, that it just generally makes everything work better, every organ of my body. So if, if um, you have a quarter in here, uh, take that quarter and put it on the back of your hand because that's all the pressure it, it needs to begin to create nerve pressure on wherever that nerve goes. So people say, they'll come into me all the time and they'll say, well, you know, doc, it was my neck and shoulders bothering me. Why are you messing with my low back? Well, because you tell me which nerves you don't want functioning 100%, okay. what organ or what part. So in other words, it's not just for pain, but those nerves go to the heart, the liver, the spleen, the kidneys, the male and female. So if you tell me which ones you don't want working 100%, I'm, I'm happy to not adjust that area. But they're all connected. What's that song? The something's connected. Yeah, hip bone to connected to the leg bone. Yeah, yeah very true song. Do you know it? Back Can in you the sing day. it? I... You want to keep your audience, you don't want me singing. God's blessed me with a we lot of things. We were hoping to build an audience. Yeah, God's blessed me with a lot of things. Singing is not one of them. I rest in church on the verse that says make a joyful noise. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, anyway, um, I did want to say good morning to a friend of mine, Jack Riddle. He must be listening. Jack, I'm giving away the farm, you commented, and it's only because Denrek has condemned it. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Smile, Jack. Good that. morning. Good morning, Jack. So anyway, if you pass any donut places on the way here, uh, <coughs> glazed, glazed donuts would be welcome. Hey, does T.S. Smith down the road still have donuts, Brooks? I haven't been there in a while, but I know those donuts they have, the fresh ones, oh, my goodness, they're incredible. If anybody knows that answer, drop a bag off here. <laughs> <laughs> if I had known it went right by there, yeah. I could have stopped. All right, well, what else you got to tell us? Well, hey, are you you doing the Toys for Tots down there? Yes. No, it's not Toys for Tots, but okay, we, what is we, it? we blend okay, with the uh, Seaford Blades something. Associated Charities. Oh, okay, okay. And uh, we've done this over 25 years now. Wow. Every year for 25 years. Yeah, and we've, and yeah. we've been very blessed. I've always been a big Christmas guy. And, uh, you know, I wanted to do the have the Santa come to the office and do that thing, but it's, uh, it's more difficult than one would think because okay. a lot of people take advantage of that situation. And Santa's so, busy. Santa's busy, and so we tied in with Seaford Blades. Uh, Jenny Short's been just an absolute blessing over the years. Wow. And so if you have a gift or a toy, drop it off at our office. We're going to have a little drawing for some things we're going to give away. But wow. uh, it's, it's been a great, great thing uh, year well, after year. Well, thank you for doing that, that for all those years. Oh, it's, it's exciting. You know, we, we always want to do more like everybody else does. Mm -hmm. But it's all of our patients. It's unbelievable. We got started a little late this year because of other things we had going on. I mean, and my patients were coming to me saying, hey, T, when do we bring what's the toys? The, what's the deal know? here? Yeah. Right. So, yeah, it's going very well. We're very excited. But it's a great thing to hook up with. And a lot of organizations, we team together, so they'll have a lot of toys to give uh, for kids. And last year, we were able to give. Uh, we had enough left over. We could do Seaford, Laurel, and Delmar. Um, Golly, so it, it was it was a great well, blessing. Now, you're right on the highway, very conveniently located, easy in, easy out. You don't have to go in the middle of a big shopping center or something like that. You could just pull right off of the highway on the northbound side of 13. Yes. And you got the big spine tight mailbox, mailbox stand. Yes, sir. And um, what what kind of hours are you open? Five days a week? Yeah, we're open Monday through Friday um, right. from usually 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. That's okay. a good average. Someone will answer the phone all day and most of the night, as you know. Okay. Uh, so Peninsula Cairo, and as you're spelling chiropractic, it'll come up. Okay. Peninsulacairo.com. Just make sure it's the one up. in Delaware, right? Make sure so there's the other ones in California. You okay. can go to that one. It's a little far. Right. Uh, people see my uncle's trucks, my cousin's trucks. It's his trillia on the side of the big tractor trailer. Okay. That's my mobile clinic. Okay. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, so we're working on that next. But, uh, okay. yes, that's where we're right up on the dual highway. And you do massage. It's like if I wanted to talk Brooks into dealing with you, because yes. obviously Brooks is in the market for a chiropractor. He's in the market. I might He's in the that. market. we got to figure out what would sway a young man like this to go to a chiropractor twice a week. That's it. That's it. <laughs> Once or, a month. Or twice a day. Twice a day. <laughs> I was shooting a little low. Yeah, that's, all right. that's all right. You're new at this. We'll get it. All right. But anyway, <laughs> so first of all, 
it's a it's a it's a very accommodating place. When I call, I say, can I get in maybe this day or this time or this? Very accommodating. I like that. In other words, you know, sometimes you call and they're like, no soup for you. Meaning, <laughs> no, not this day. But yes, this day where I call down there and they, they're always accommodating, especially if I'm hurting or just think I'm hurting or something like that. So it's a friendly place, okay? Local people, all right? Always got a smile. Everybody's in an upbeat. And it's like a mini army down there. In other words, uh, so you go in and you sign in and they uh, take your insurance. Um, so I know that. I don't know what your deductible is, Brooks. I haven't studied your entire plan. But anyway. And they take a flex spending card? Uh, yeah, they do, actually. Yes, they do. You got flex dollars not used? I do. Honestly, until. You better use them or you're going to lose them. Not until June 30th, right? Well, it's coming up. <laughs> it's right around the corner. If you start going twice a day, though. It's Christmas, then it's summer. Right? Yeah, it's Christmas, <laughs> then it's summer. <laughs> anyway, yes, they take flex spending. Um, but I want to tell you something they really have that you would like. What's that? Is the massages. That's oh, awesome. I'm sure. Absolutely. And I hate to tell you this, but your insurance, I believe, I hate to speak for the insurance, I think it'll cover a half an hour massage. <laughs> it's funny but, on the time thing that you spoke about because we had a lady upset the other day. She came in a half hour early, okay, for her appointment. Okay. And lots of times if you're there early, if we can work it out, we'll try to get you in. We know people are busy. Okay. But we were actually five minutes after her actual designated time, and she was upset with us. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, and my wife, oh, another doctor. my wife just came back yesterday with her mother from the cardiologist. Okay. Sat in the waiting room two hours Two hours waiting for a cardiologist. Yeah. Now, I know, you know, things happen, but, yeah, we're usually trying to be pretty punctual, too. <laughs> I agree with that. Well, but you know what that lends to? The personal treatment you get when they do see you because you're not rushing. Yeah. So yeah. if somebody's got something that's that's going on and they, and they need an extra minute or two, I have found that you're very courteous with your time. So I guess if you have to wait five minutes longer than normal, think about it when you're in the room and you're getting five more minutes service than you uh, – yes. Yeah, you're not. This person was a little cute. If you were, you'd want me to spend a few more minutes with yes. you. But it's we're never, I mean, we're never, I mean, we try, our policy is if I'm more than 15 minutes late, the staff's to come get me. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, so we really make try sure to Make sure you're stay, not snoozing. Yeah, make sure I'm not taking a nap <laughs> in the back. So we try to keep on time. Thank you. All right. Well, that's Dr. T. What is it? 629-4344? Yes, sir. Man, I got it memorized. Down the side. 629, for normal business hours, you're going to get pretty much a live human being in. I'm expecting a full report from you soon. <laughs> Okay? Yes. <laughs> and I'll be able to tell because you'll be standing taller. Doc, can you hang out with us for a little bit? Yeah, I'd love to. Great okay. morning. So, yeah, let's hang out. I'm sorry there's no glazed donuts here yet, but yep. I'll still hang out. Well, we still got time. I think Jack Riddle's awake. All right. I do want to talk about First Class Heating and Air again. I mentioned them earlier on in the show. Really great people. I have people say to me, man, people that advertise on your show, and these are people that advertise on my show, but I kind of hand pick them. And I pick people that I like dealing with and that I enjoy promoting. And First Class Heating and Air is a company that I have personal experience with. I've bought, I can't remember if it's two or three heating systems off of them, air conditioning. I've had some stuff repaired. Um, I actually had many different projects done by them, the encapsulation underneath my house and so on. So I'm very happy with them. So if you need some heating work or air conditioning work, you probably don't need any air conditioning work right now. But even if you have like rental houses and stuff like that, you need service work done or or just your own house or your business or whatever. They work on commercial stuff. They work on residential stuff. Their people are background checked. Their vehicles are lettered. They're wearing uniforms. They've been serving Delmarva, which would mean Delaware and Maryland, for over 40 years. Think about that. Locally owned, locally operated, 24-7 emergency service. Really, really good place to deal. Okay? So, here's the deal. If you give them a call, 934-8900, they will give you free estimates on anything you need done. They even have financing plans. Like, for example, let's say you have a problem with your heater and it turns out, dang, you know, it's going to cost this much to fix it or this much to get a brand new one, but I wasn't prepared for that. They offer financing, too. So, well, I guess that's based on approved credit, but um, whose isn't? So, anyway, give them a call, 934-8900, then they're on the web First class HVAC people that want me to help promote their business. And um, I'm looking for somebody that does blacktop sealing. Um, I'm going to have some blacktop sealing that I need done. So if you offer that service and you'd like me to advertise your business in exchange for some blacktop sealing, I've got a bunch of properties that are going to need that done. What's another thing? I want a Renai hot water heater at my house. So if you are in the business and you install those, 
I'm open to maybe doing a little swapping and trading there. Um, um, I think that's about all I need right now. Brooks, is there anything else I need? I need some fencing done. Yeah. If do. there's a fencing contractor listening and says, hey, I'd like to swap some fencing work for um, advertising on your show, I'm up for that. So um, that's where we're at. What's next, Brooks Ritter? I think you want to talk about us again. Who's us? So we're okay. Be opening at nine. Opening at nine. Man, that's going to be a late night, isn't it? <laughs> oh, you meant nine this morning. <laughs> hey, nine can I talk morning. about something else? Sure. This is a Weller's related thing, okay? Uh, right, we're carports. Carports. I believe that carports are starting to get behind because of weather. Yeah. Okay. Weather and, and orders. I mean, well, I guess they have experienced phenomenal growth this past year. Yeah. Unbelievable. One at what, February or March? Uh, we're probably pushing March 8th. Support, folks. Um, you need to be talking to us. Yeah, definitely. You know, in, don't, here don't wait yeah. till January if you want one in April, because then if you order it in January, you're going to be talking May. Yeah. And that's all based on a mild winter. Mm hmm. Yeah, if we, if get a lot we have of anything snow. less than a mild winter, it changes everything. Yeah. So that's kind of new to us. In other words, we're kind of used to it's on the shelf. How much is it? Let's make a deal. And there it goes out the door. These carports, and I guess the sheds are kind of the same way, right? Mm -hmm. um, I guess the neat thing about a shed is they build those inside. They, build the, they make the carports inside, but they got to assemble them and anchor them down once they get there. If the ground's frozen and stuff like that, it changes everything. Yeah, and you also got to remember that on the carport side, these guys are coming mostly out of, like, North Carolina and that area, so they're not used to, to lots this, of snow. Right, they get up here roads. and it's freezing. It, ex exactly, so it's, you know, they're a little more cautious on sending out okay. delivery teams right. with the threat of snow, with the – you know, two inches, which we know, you know, two inches, you, you could still come and, and get through and all that stuff. Right, because they're not going to drive all the way from the Carolinas for a $1,000 carport yeah. and have to turn around and go back home. Exactly. They, they get, you know. Because the ground's frozen. Through 250 miles up the, up the road and find out, oh, man, now we got, you know, six inches of snow forecasted coming down. We so, sell Carolina carports. Yeah. And they can go to our website and learn a lot about it, which is wellers.com. Yep. Is that right? That's correct. Um, or they can get it's all about. We have some nice literature. We have numerous displays. There's one out in front of the building that's there's all the different roof pitches. Yep. And there's one down there that's, isn't it like a 20-something a by 20-something two-car garage for less than $7,000? Yep. Yep. or dollars sixty-two fifty. Isn't that amazing? Mm -hmm. Wow. So anyway, folks, whether you need a garage, a carport, or whatever, you can get them taller than normal and, and, and who knows what. Dr. T, I got a question for you. You have. Excellent. Well, we actually just did our Christmas party at the Abbott's Grill in Milford, but we are we were just blown away with the food. Now you've ate at Abbott's Grill in Laurel. Yeah, yes. And um, how was it? Very good, very nice. They I mean, they took an incredible amount of time just to clean up the building again before they even reopened. Oh yeah, they're first and, class. Uh, got to speak with the young man that owns it and the young lady that runs it and just their like chamber meetings little get togethers there and they would serve different foods there. oh wow so it, in that it, back room yes and they got a nice view all oh, them windows beautiful. all around it and everything and of course that back deck the side deck with the water yep. right there so yeah. it's, it's very beautiful also in the spring to sit out there in the summer wow so abbott's yeah, grill you job. have you have eaten ate there eaten ate whatever eaten, the word is i have eaten there would you eat there again i indeed would i haven't been to the one in milford uh, okay or if that's where very it is. nice uh, but everybody says it's it's magnificent but yes the laurel they've done a great job um, they have a nice little room in the back. That's where we um, had our Christmas party. And what we really liked, and I mean, they don't do it in all. They let us order from the menu. Yeah, we were was, a small, nice. small, big group, but they let us, and that was kind of nice, in other words. But they have a Milford location, um, which is right on Northeast Front Street, and um, they also have the Laurel location. They have a website, which is Abbott's A B B O T T S Grill. De com Abbott's Grill De com man you go on there and you click on it now a holiday gift card promotion where if you buy a two hundred and fifty dollar gift card you get another fifty dollars free so that's like a twenty percent deal um, they also have I don't know the exact wording for it but like a frequent customer program I just got my card in the mail the other day let me see what that's called um, but I'm very happy with them I like the oh it's called a loyalty member. A loyalty member and how it works is I think I paid $25 to join and they immediately loaded $25 on my card so it actually cost me nothing to join and then a percentage of every time I eat there goes towards um, some kind of additional 
you know, money going on my card. Um, I should have. Nice. Very nice. Yeah, very nice. In other words, but the food is great. Their burgers are good. Um, we had a what was that called? A shinkatig crab, crab cake. cake. Man, that was good. Jason had roast beef. No, no. What did he have? No, meat was, he had the meatloaf. Meat loaf. Yeah, the meat but they also the have loaf. a prime rib night there. Um, they Monday nights is a seven dollar burger. What did Jimmy have? A burger and a crab cake. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he was chowing down. <laughs> So, oh, we got to take a break, folks. We'll be right back. WellerDoesDelmarva.com. You can watch us during the break. We'll be right back with the final half hour of the show. Stay tuned. season, we suggest you shop in local businesses. For every $100 spent at locally owned stores, most of that money stays right here in the local economy. But when you shop online, nothing comes home. You see, where you shop does make a difference. This is General Manager Mike Hazala reminding you that what you spend here stays here. Keep it local this holiday season. For great ideas on how you can help keep it local this holiday season, check out the Keep It Local Holiday Gift Guide at Delaware1059.com. Chock full of local businesses with great holiday gift ideas and special offers like Holland Jewelers. Holland Jewelers 25th Annual Storewide Christmas Sale is going on now through Christmas Eve. Get an exceptional gift at an exceptional price at Holland Jewelers, Route 24, Peddler's Village Shopping Center in Lewis. Happy Holidays from Delaware 105.9. CBS News Update. I'm Gary Nahn. The gasoline pump price plunge continues. We have at least another month of gasoline prices continuing to drop. And we're talking about national prices that are 65 cents lower than they were a year ago. Robert Sinclair of the AAA, which says the cost of a gallon of unleaded regular right now is 257 nationwide. Looking ahead, Tom Closer of the Oil Price Information Service. I think it will go to that range of 199 to 229, and then it'll bounce up uh, in the spring, as it always does. Saudi Arabia is king. There's also the notion that they may want to punish Iran in the region or they want to punish Russia for meddling in the region. There's another theory that says they want to put the oil shale production boom uh, to a little bit of a rest. The price drop is all about oversupply with OPEC hanging tough and the U.S. producing more oil than at any time since Richard Nixon was president. CBS News Update, I'm Gary Nunn. Park Place Jewelers' holiday tradition continues, giving you the best gifts of love and memories. At Park Place Jewelers, choose from sparkling diamonds, gemstones, gold and silver, to engagement rings and so much more. And in keeping with Park Place Jewelers' Christmas tradition, any purchase you make between now and Christmas Eve will be free if it snows one inch at the Ocean City Airport on New Year's Eve day between noon and midnight. Park Place Jewelers' friends and satisfied customers came so close to having their Christmas gifts for free last year when it snowed one inch the day after New Year's that you have nothing to lose at Park Place Jewelers. You get the special items you want to give as gift funded, making your holidays just that much brighter. Park Place Jewelers at the White Marlin Mall, Route 50 West Ocean City, and on the boards between 2nd and 3rd Streets. Let Park Place Jewelers put a sparkle in your Christmas this year. Looking for jewelry, I'm a place, Park Place Jewelers. Are you interested in a fireplace? How about a patio or even an outdoor kitchen? Does your roof need to be repaired, or do you need a new roof? Well, you're in luck. Listen Saturday mornings with me, Fran the Man, from 1030 until 11 o'clock Improvement Tips Program. Worth and Company, they've got an outstanding reputation for top quality products and workmanship. Worth and Company, since 1926. This is Butch Emmert from Emmert Auction Associates in Rehoboth Beach. I want to invite you to a terrific Delaware multi-estate sale at the Rehoboth Beach Convention Center tomorrow, 9.30 a.m. We will have two auctioneers all day. Six major estates, including Delaware Original Art by Ethel Leach, Howard Schroeder, Edmund Darch Lewis. Six works by the late Tom Wilson, Connie Cossin, Bethany Boardwalk. We have terrific period furniture, modern furniture, and antique furniture, estate jewelry, oriental rugs, 
Cubs, China Glassware, Canton, three great cars, four tags, including Delaware 9002, 1826, a PC tag, and two three-digit Ducks Unlimited tags. Terrific early Lewis Ships Captain's Desk, Walnut Chess. We have a period game table line at emeraldauction.com or auctionzip.com. Hello, I'm Pete Booker, president of Delmarva Broadcasting Company. We are dedicated to equal employment opportunity. When a job opening occurs in our company, we notify community groups who can inform their interested members. We'd like to hear from any group that helps people find jobs. Please contact us at 302-422-7575 to sign up. This job listing service is a free equal employment opportunity outreach program provided by Delmarva Broadcasting Company. I love music, and I'm very excited to be broadcasting live from Keyboard America Furniture in Laurel, Delaware, today from 11 to 1. If you have any questions about getting you or a family member started in piano lessons, or if you always wanted to play but think it's too late to learn, you need to call in or come see, touch, and hear these amazing new Yamaha pianos with pricing and deals you'd expect to find at Johnny Janosik. Experience the Yamaha Disclavier Player Piano, streaming over 30 music stations, all controlled from your iPad or iPhone. Bring live concerts from around the world right into your living room, played right on your piano by artists like Elton John, Sarah McLaughlin, Barry Manilow, Alicia Keys, and many more. Stop by or call into the Jared Moore Show today from 11 to 1 for the grand opening of Keyboard America's Christmas Showroom, located inside Johnny Genotics' World of Furniture in tax-free Laurel, Delaware. The following program is a paid commercial presentation. The comments, views, and opinions expressed do not necessarily reflect the views of the staff, management, or advertisers of Delaware 105.9. Doing the break for all of you that were watching at WellerDoesDelmarva.com. We've got some breaking news for you. I've got to finish my Abbott's Grill ad first, and then I'm going to move into the breaking news. Is that okay? Well, that's fine. Okay. I'm going to tell you how good... 105.9 works, all right? If you're listening and you say, I may just be thinking about advertising, um, I'm going to tell you a story here in just a second. But Abbott's Grill, let's I had scalps as an Who appetizer. Who paid for this dinner? The boss did. So you ordered an appetizer? Yes, and a dessert. <laughs> and a dessert? I probably shouldn't be saying that. Dang, go on. Big appetizer. Oh, he orders you a know, large appetizer. Like some people are very polite. They'll order an appetizer, but not Brooks. He orders an appetizer, a meal, and a dessert. I was Please tell me you drank water. Uh, no. I, drank. <laughs> <laughs> I was just following everybody. Did you have a tip? <laughs> no. Okay. I saw a <laughs> this day. He orders an appetizer <laughs> and a meal. And a dessert. And a dessert. And he wasn't kind enough to just drink water. He also ordered a drink. Is there anything else? Did you get any gift cards while you were there, too? No, no gift cards. No All gift right. Cards. Take <laughs> <laughs> he has no pride. There's no hope to it. My, my kids had the macaroni. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> that affects your kids, too? <laughs> kids and the wife. Okay. They're and all that, thanking you, Joe. That macaroni and cheese. Okay. But it was probably the best macaroni and cheese I've ever had in my life. It was incredible. Well, then it was all <laughs> the <laughs> silence. <laughs> Thank you, Jim. Brooks, if you're happy, I'm happy. In other words, what more can I say? I live to please Brooks Ritter. There so Abbott's Grill really did it for you, your wife, and your children. And the boss. And the boss. The boss. Family. Okay. It was fantastic, folks. So I'm just letting you know, if you've never been to Abbott's Grill in Milford, just go there for dinner one night or something like that. If you need somebody to go with you, I can uh, probably talk to my wife and I to go out to dinner with you. We're always looking for people to buy us a dinner. Or so, uh, Brooks will go. Or, yeah, <laughs> if not, I can send Brooks. All right? Abbott's Grill. What in the world's the phone number? I had it a minute ago. But anyway, um, they do a good job. They do catering. Um, I'm very happy with them, and I just want to encourage you to check them out. I can't find the daggone phone number. Um, oh, I got to mention one more thing. You know what else they got, Brooks, where what? we should have went after dinner? What's that? To the Mississippian Fitness Center. Oh, they do. That, <laughs> they own great. a fitness center now, in other words, just a few doors down. So, anyway, phone number is, phone number in Milford, 491-6736, 491-6736. And then in Laurel, where Dr. T dines, 280-6172, 280-6172. Now, we're going to jump from... That food to the power of advertising. We advertise on the radio. 
Um, I don't know how many people are listening. I know it's in the hundreds of thousands to millions of listeners, maybe. I don't know, however big Sussex County is. And we had put it out there if T.S. Smith & Sons has donuts or not anymore. And lo and behold, um, a saint walks through the door. <laughs> Thanks, Jim. Dan Bell. Is that right? Yes, good morning. Good morning. And what has he got? Bags of donuts. Warm. T.S. Smith and Sons. Warm, sweet T.S. Smith donuts. I just heard you guys asking. I thought it would be a nice gesture for the holidays. To what stop took by. you so long? <laughs> that was quick. That, that was, was wonderfully quick. So what are you up to? Oh, man, hustling. I got a lot of jobs, a lot of careers, a lot of gigs. Um, staying busy for the holidays. Love your show. I love Dan's show. 105.9, oh, very effective. It very is effective, yeah. In other words. You guys um, got donuts just for asking. Yeah. And, <laughs> you can't um, get somebody's business unless you ask for it. So mm -hmm. well, Come on well, down to Weller's today. Save you thousands on a trailer. There folks. you go. They sell more trailers than anybody in the region. Yep, thank you for that. Uh, now the pet, Boutique. Yeah, the pet boutique, uh, my girlfriend and I, uh, we secured five acres of land. It took uh, two years to fit wow. out the building. That was quick. <laughs> yeah, it was. Um, yeah, hey, Could have been worse. I hope Trust nobody me. official is yeah. listening. Well, I, I do hope they're listening. But, uh, but you know how I actually got the entrance permit from Del Dot for that building was uh, a dozen donuts, Jim. There you go. Donuts are powerful tools. Powerful tool. <laughs> anyway, so um, you gave us a discount card here. Is that right? Yeah, there's there's only a couple here left. I think you got three extra. Yep. $5 off your first groom. My girlfriend, Marcia, she's a great groomer. She's been doing right. it eight years. Very passionate about what she does. And she's on Facebook, so they can like her fa pace. Yeah, Whoa. it's the, uh, the, the, the Pet, pet Boat, B-O-W-T-I-Q-U-E, Grooming Salon at Facebook. Um, all breeds are welcome. All breeds welcome. Big dogs, small go. dogs. All right. $5 off your first groom. Appreciate the shout-out, Jim. That's not why right. I stopped by. I know, thank I know. you for that. I just thought I'd do it anyway. I was recently at a dinner with the Delaware Auctioneers Association. Yeah, and uh, you were there auctioning, and I was quite impressed with you. You did a good I job. I appreciate so. that. Next time you want to have an auction, yeah. I um, – You're ready. I'll charge you if a I have bit. product. <laughs> if I have product, you're ready to sell it. I could sell it. Well, maybe we'll work something out someday. You never I know. I appreciate you guys. Thanks for uh, putting okay. on this great show. And um, well, Thank you for coming in. Yeah, I just want to let you know as a listener, and this is a good, and way, I appreciate to, good that. way to do that. We like our listeners. Next, we're going to be asking for crab cakes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, that's a little out of my mind. All right, now, well, you can't get them in the morning, so it'll be easy on you. Hey, the Jim. donuts were a welcome blessing. Thank I got you. connections at Jimmy's. You want okay. some crab cakes. They may not be cooked, but I'll get them here. Jim. All right. <laughs> thank you very much, Dan. Appreciate Merry it. Christmas to you. The Pet Boutique, a positive grooming experience. Route 9 and Old Furnace. Positive. 856 Paws. P A W S. Okay. Thanks, Jim. Thank you. Merry Christmas to you. All right, Abbott's Grill. We talked about them. Uh, we've talked about Dan Bell and um, the Pet Bow. What is it? The Pet Boutique, right? So we need people to like that Facebook page if they would. Now, I'm going to move into the next thing. No nonsense office machines. While we're on the subject of good places to deal, they have been my copier sales and repair center for years, 20 plus years. Uh, Rick Fowler does a great job, good friend of mine. And um, he also sells things like laptops and tablets and computers and fax machines. He works on gaming systems. He also sells printers. He works on things. He sells things. He's honest. He's friendly. He'll give you a good fair score square deal so if you need something worked on or if you want to buy something or if you think you want to buy something and you want to talk to somebody because he was sharing with me he says you know you can go pretty much anywhere and buy a computer but the one thing he can do is help guide you through the process and help you from or almost prevent you from getting a computer loaded with a bunch of junk you don't need that just makes it complicated or slows it down. So if you need something worked on, whether it's a gaming system, whether it's a copier, whether it's a computer, whatever, he's your guy. Give him a call, 856-7381, 856-7381. Real nice guy, honest, friendly, sincere, located just two miles east of Georgetown, two miles of the cir east of the circle on Route 9, right next to Sports at the Beach Complex, 856-7381. Tell him I sent you. Dr. T, you got anything else on your mind? Again, if you're looking for some gift certificates, we have oh, that our office. We also have gift certificates. We have the world's best 6 to 15 minute a day exercise program. Wow. We're going to be launching that concept and uh, in January. So if you'd like to come in and check that out, it's for any age. Uh, we have gift certificates, $80 complimentary gift certificates just to see what it's all about. Uh, we're happy to do that. So you're saying like if somebody just is like Brooks or 
whatever. Um, Brooks may be a difficult study. Yes. But anyway, <laughs> um, if somebody is just not sure if chiropractic is even yes. for them or if they even want to deal with your group, they That's can right. give a call, make an appointment, just have a complimentary chat. To share with them about the insurance, how it works. Right. And then if, they, if it's not for them, they can do what the Left Bank song says and walk away, Renee. But okay. Yeah, whatever they need. Also, Jim, I sent a young lady. I don't know if you still have it up here. For those who are a lot of racing fans out there, some a lady, one of my patients asked me, said she was going to get her husband this tool chest, a two. Oh, a yeah. And I said, my friend Jim Weller just had, I don't know if you have any more. I think uh, we do. But yep. so I've, yes. I've sent her up. So those out there looking for that, uh, yep. race fans, that's here. Explain that, Jim. What that it was is. like a Stanley tool. Roll around. Yeah, has four caster wheels, yep. Four caster. What's four caster mean? Four. Oh, caster four caster wheels. wheels. Okay. <laughs> I thought you know, like they were going to forecast the weather or something. I'm like, what are you talking about? I mean, let's build them up, Brooks, but let's not build them up too much, okay? So four caster wheels, folks. That's probably one on each corner. That's correct. Okay? So it's a bottom toolbox with some drawers in it, and then it's a top toolbox with some drawers in it, and 50 or 60 tools, something like that. Yeah, it's 60, 68, I believe. Was it 68 or 50 or 60? You keep talking, I'll tell you in a okay, second. Okay, he's looking it up. 68 piece mechanic tool set. There All right. Is. So now what if you're a non-mechanic? Can you still use the tools? It's sockets and, and stuff like that. So I'm sure you could still use them. You don't something. have to be certified to be able to use them? That's correct. So you get the 68 piece tool set <laughs> and the toolbox. That's correct. What is it, like 247 How much money? $117.50. Not what we paid for them. What are we selling them for? That's what we're selling them for. No tax. One hundred and seventeen dollars and fifty cents. One seventeen fifty. Yep. Think about that now. You're saying you get sixty-eight tools. Yep. And a bottom and top toolbox. That's correct. So how much is the toolboxes? The toolbox is one hundred and seventeen fifty. And how much are the tools? One hundred and seventeen fifty. You get both. So the you get sixty-eight tools and two toolboxes for one hundred seventeen fifty. Yes, that's correct. Is there a handling fee? Can we at least charge something like that? That's up to you. You're the boss. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, these guys, when they price stuff and I'm not around, it does bother me a smidgen. <laughs> because I'd rather start at maybe like 247 and see where we can go from there. I have this crazy theory. Ask for what you want, settle for what you can get. That's what sales is about. Ask for donuts, you get donuts. All right, I do got two more things, or a couple things. Um, this is a fundraiser going on today. I believe this family, it's called the Bear, B-A-R-E, Family Fundraiser, okay? It's actually today, Saturday, December 13th at 3.30 this afternoon at the American Legion Post 28 in Millsboro. It's going to be an auction. Um, you just come through the double doors. or accepting auction items, so if you have anything you'd like to donate, this family lost everything and a fire, in other words, and the father, he's a veteran, but it's a, I think it's a husband and wife and some kids. I don't know. I don't personally know him. I just know it's a real need for the community to get behind this. They are going to be gathering up auction items. We donated something, and then they are auctioning it off starting at 3.30 today. If you have any questions at all or 1-233-272-1233 for any additional information, uh, that is today at 3.30. There's one more thing I want you to mark your calendar for. This is an inaugural prayer breakfast, a time at Crossroad Community Church. It's on January 13th at 7.30 in the morning. Great way to meet some of your local um, uh, master of ceremonies will be Tim Dukes, uh, special music by the Crossroad Praise Team, and then, of course, a great breakfast. Admission is only $10. For more information or to get tickets, go to crossroadcommunitychurch.net. Um, a good event. Just get out, meet people, and fellowship, and uh, break bread, and talk to one another, and so on. Have we been giving these calendars away like crazy? Yes, we have. Now, what is the deal? One is free. One is free, two for a dollar. How many is three? How much three cost? We'll, we'll give you another free one. Okay. <laughs> so you can buy two for a dollar. Yeah. Now, when we get the four, what happens? Oh, you're 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 confusing me. Golly, Dave Brooks, you told, me, you told me at eight forty-five. Is it, folks? Let's get a verification here. <laughs> eight forty-nine. Eight forty-nine. <laughs> Come on, Brooks. Oh, it's, it's if one delay, is free, fog delay. one is free, <laughs> two for a dollar, yeah. three would be a dollar total. Yeah, four would be a dollar. When you get the four, it's two dollars. Yeah, okay? You're trying to trip me up Brooks this morning. Brooks Ritter is his name, folks. If you would like to meet him in person, <laughs> he'll, be the guy, he'll be the guy with a bag of donuts <laughs> walking around the show yep. room. <laughs> See if you can uh, pick me up as quick as Jim can. Oh, I was doing it slowly. It wasn't even quickly. <laughs> Oh, my goodness. Oh. Let's talk about power washing. Absolutely. Let me get you off the hook here, sure. okay? Thank you. Scott Sockrider is a guy who has been buying some advertising on my show. Thank you, Scott. Appreciate you being a supporter. And he has professional 
Power Wash. And um, he has done a few jobs for me now and um, really happy with him. Did my daughter's house and my son's house and my house and um, my uh, website called The Professional Power Wash.com. The T H E, The Professional Power Wash.com. He also is on Facebook, Power Washing Delaware. That's it, Power Washing Delaware. Wow. But you know what he told me? He said he'll go all the way to like Wilmington or something like that. So anyway, he'll uh, go all the way from the Pennsylvania line to the Virginia line and everywhere in between. Now, you and I would do that for food, sure. but he'll actually do it to do power <laughs> washing, okay? Yeah. In other words, so um, if you have a house you want power washed or your decks or some steps or trucks or farm machinery or tractor trailers or... So I'm thinking that's that going like to be a, a little job. bit of a greasy <laughs> job, you know. But anyway, real good guy, real good hard worker. Um, give him a call. What in the world's his phone number? 858-858-9568. That's 858-95-questions. I found him to almost be half the price of everybody else I've ever dealt with. I really like the guy, and I appreciate him supporting our show. Now, this is our 67th show. Yep. So next week's show will be what number, Brooks? Let me think. Let me think. 68. <laughs> okay, everybody. <laughs> We're past the 1245, 8, 845, 845 uh, mark. 50, you know, it was a five-minute fog delay, so now I'm Okay, gonna go. he's yeah. good to go. Next, what in the world are these things? You're going to have to tell me how much they are. It's like die-cast okay. tractor trailers. They diesel or gas? They are neither. No. Exactly. But my grandson didn't view it as a collector's item. They <laughs> in other words. So um, we've got these. Now, Baltimore Ravens, I doubt in Delaware... That is the there. most popular one we have. Right what? Now. Yeah. We sell boxes upon boxes upon boxes. Of people people okay. keep them in the box. <laughs> All right. So we got those. Is that right? Yep. Now, who in the world is this? The Cincinnati, Cincinnati Reds? Reds? Yep. Okay. Not then, quite as popular. Not quite as popular. <laughs> How about the Milwaukee Brewers? The same same boat. Which boat? <laughs> the not quite as oh. popular. How about the uh, Braves, the, the Braves. Atlanta Braves? That was somewhat popular. Yep. Somewhat. Okay. Yep. Now, what about this one? The Texas Rangers? That's probably the second most popular one. The Ravens is the most popular. Absolutely. Five Do you five. like this team or something? No, no, I'm no. an Eagles oh. fan. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, we'll step on. Which are these? Do you know? They are seven fifty. Okay. Two for ten. All right, and how much are four? Twenty. Okay, he got it. <laughs> All right, folks, it's just about time to let Brooks go into sales for the day. Okay. <laughs> I so passed my test. You passed your test. Okay. Is that called a litmus test? I, I Dr. Don't know T, about you're that. the doctor. Is yes, that what it's Yes, it that would be. A a, a me, we'll call it a metaphor for that. Yes, we hear that people uh, don't see. And so. 1,700 wires. <laughs> at least 1,700 wires. So he's doing a great job. Oh, and he likes it when you push that red button right oh, there. Yeah, that's right. That sends him to a panic. <laughs> yeah. So anyway. Uh, More stuff and, on my And every time everything goes wrong, he uses the word the Internet, bandwidth, <laughs> stuff like that. In other words, so. um Keep you confused, Jim. That's the key. Yeah. Right, because that's all that's foreign language that, to yeah. me. So what are you doing today, young man? Got some shopping to do, got some reports to write, just all over the place. So wow. having a great day, you know, Good. church tomorrow, and just having a great weekend. Dan Bell, what are you doing today? Well, listen, um, I'm going to stop by a couple of flea markets, do some networking, promote the pet boutique, and okay. uh, maybe a little light Christmas shopping. Okay. I might pick up two of these uh, Baltimore Ravens uh, pickup okay. trucks for $10. That's a steal. See, I <laughs> almost think these could be bought and resold. Would you view it possibly that I'm gonna way? I'm going to resell them. I'm just yeah, okay. <laughs> be honest with us here. <laughs> the Weller does them. Marvel. we're having a good time here in case you don't know it. Um, I do want to invite people out to Jimmy's Grill next Friday morning. Dan Gaffney is going on vacation. And so I will be co-hosting that show next Friday morning at Jimmy's Grill. So I'm inviting anybody that wants to stop by and say howdy and, uh, you know, just join us for a good time of fun and fellowship and hanging out. It's from 530 in the morning till 10. So um, it's going to be a good time. And um, I hopefully will do his show justice. But the show you're listening to right now is Weller Does Delmarva. And uh, we're um, mm -hmm. and um, every day that number keeps growing. Yep. But if you would be so kind as to go to Facebook. Now, what all we got there? We got Weller Does Delmarva. Yep. So they can like that, right? That's correct. All right. Then what's the next thing? Jim Weller. I'm the Jim Weller from, from Delaware, Delaware, not no, Alaska, right? That's a friend's page. Okay. Yep. So they got to friend me there. Then what? Weller Sheds and Car Parva, Weller's Utility Trailers. Both that, of those are likes pages. Okay. So Weller's Utility Trailers. Yep. Okay. So if they do all of those, what do they win? Absolutely nothing. Okay. Let's <laughs> give them one of these. Sure. A calendar, Jim. A calendar. That's right. <laughs> 
their second calendar free. Okay. <laughs> Let's do this. We got these beautiful mugs, Weller Does Del Marva mugs. And then on the other side, it says Weller's Utility Trailers. Uh, these here were one of the nicest made in China mugs I could find. Okay. I had my coffee this morning out of that very mug. Okay. Anyway, I just want to let you know that uh, we will give you one of these absolutely free if you friend me and like Weller Does Del Marva, like Weller Sheds and Carports, and friend. I got it backwards. You got it backwards. Help me here, Brooks. Fr uh, friend Weller Sheds and Carports and like Weller's Utility Trailers. And then friend Jim Weller. Yep. And Was there a fourth one? Yeah, Weller Does Del Marva. I like it. You got to do all four. Yep. Triple play. Quadruple play. Quadruple play. Yep. Okay. <laughs> I was testing you. A Weller Does Del Marva slash Weller's Utility Trailers coffee mug. All right. And what will it cost them? It will cost them nothing. Any sales tax? No sales tax. Handling fees? And they're microwavable. Microwave, but l l listen to this little thing. I pull this out. It says, you're the tops. Put your new custom mug only on the top rack of the dishwasher, and it will stay in tip-top condition. Your mug is microwavable, too. Use care when removing your mug from the microwave. The handle may be hot. <laughs> They're covering you their stick bases. Your finger. All right, so you get one of them free if they do all of that. Is that right? That's correct. Okay, what else you got you want to say? We do have an ad that's running right now. I wanted to. Um, Are you having fun? Draw their attention to you. Absolutely, always. I love. Where are you getting mornings. Rural Farms coffee? Uh, rural Farms on the way here. <laughs> <laughs> but we have an ad. It's gifts ten dollars and under. Okay. And it, it is a whole bunch of things. Do you have any eleven dollar gifts? Um, I got eleven, twelve, fifteen, twenty, two hundred, five hundred, whatever okay. you want. We'll make it. Okay. But uh, we have this ad that's running right now that. Is if you're looking for stocking stuffers, it's like a list of a whole bunch of stocking stuffers that we have here at Weller's that you would never think that we would have here. So, What are you saying? Check it out. Oh, okay. You can go to Weller's.com, current ads, and it, it says Probably one of the top under. one or two, yep. right? Mm -hmm. All right. When is that ad effective? Nine o'clock today? It's effective now. <laughs> it's effective now. All right. So, and then they can get their It's Okay to Weller walls discount cards, $10 each, or three for 25 or six for 50 or 12 for 100 we're on it. So, it's been a good time. Thank you, Fran, back at the studio. Dan Gaffney, if you're listening, I hope you have a good vacation. And other than that, folks, God bless you. Have a good weekend. Join me at Eagle's Nest if you want tomorrow morning, 930. Other than that, have a blessed day. See ya. Bye. The preceding program was a paid commercial presentation. Everybody.